And welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 2. No, your eyes do not deceive you. That was an airship. Um, I'm joined as always by Luke, Nova, and Bro, our trusty squad. I'd love to say that Gray was with us too, but we're we're on our way to find him right now. At least that's the idea. Yeah, we lost him after that battle with the Black Knights. Yeah, airships, they just kind of fly around the world map here sometimes. But we can't get one for a while, if I remember right. We're on our way to Finn, which if you remember was taken over by the Imperials. That's where our hometown is. Or at least I should say, it is our hometown. Let's see if we can make it inside. Um, hold on for just one second. Okay, uh, I needed to save for a little bit because I want to show something off for you. Um, yeah, we're back in Finn. Um, yeah, look at all these soldiers here. Um, uh, what's up, soldier? Oh, oh crap. Oh, this is not good. Oh, there's just one of them, but he's a captain. That's not good. Um, you want to go all out on him. Um, because he's going to kill you. Yeah, there's pretty much nothing you can do. Oh, by the way, that's how uh, you attack with multiple weapons. I don't have anything to get to get Luke back up yet, so uh, we're just gonna we're just going to die apparently. Come on, Nova, super flame attack. That's not gonna do it. And he used arrows three, which kind of sucked, but it was still well enough to kill us. Uh, so yeah. Just, I just showed you guys this for a lesson. Um, yeah, this is a game over. Uh, don't, don't, don't talk to any of the guards here. Okay, I'll meet you back right outside. Okay, let's try this again. This time with less death. That'd be awesome if we didn't die. Um, yeah, you can't go into the inn, right? It's blocked. You can go into the magic shop, uh, but there's nobody here at all. Um, same thing with the armor and weapon shop, and there are random encounters in here. Um, pretty much the same enemies, though. I believe that the point of uh, having all these soldiers around is just to remind you that you are indeed underpowered. So what you want to do is go just north of town here, and all the way around, because over here there is a pub. Um, you can't get to the item shop either. Whatever. And yes, the place is full of guards. Don't talk to any of them. You can you can run right up to them though. I mean, you could just totally taunt them through the game. Just 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 don't press X. Um, so you want to talk to this guy here? His name's the Master. I, I think he's the tavern keeper. You know, I don't know why they call him Master. Don't come past the the the, ta the counter man. What are you doing? Um, so yeah, you want to tell him s the the password Wild Rose. Remember that's for all the rebels. And he tells you that there's an injured soldier downstairs, and then he's like, he's yours now, I'm gone, I'm getting the hell out of here, I want nothing to do with that guy anymore. So, you want to go into this secret passage, and it will lead you down here to some treasure, where you get potions, potions, and more potions. So you get three potions, and then you talk to this guy, he's a knight. If you intend to sell me to the emperor, kill me, it, you're not taking me alive. Use the password on him! Hey dude, we're here with the rebels! You're rebels, aren't you? I am Scott, Prince of Cassion. Wait, Prince Scott? Yeah, you were supposed to have died. You lied! You have to do it now. It must be true. The story must be true! My strength is fading. I have a favor to ask. Deliver a message to my brother Gordon. Tell him that he has all the makings of a great leader. He should believe in himself. And tell the King of Finn that Count Borgen serves the Empire now. That traitor is behind Finn's downfall. And to Hilda, my love will be with her always. No, do not tell her that. I am a dying man. She should find another love. And then Nova comes in and just like, Hey, nah, enough about you. Let's talk about me. Have you seen Grey? He's kind of my brother. I've been looking for him. No. Scott has not seen him. So he gets out of bed. He stands up, gets out of bed so he can hand us a ring. And and then he complains how tired he is. And, oh, he's gonna rest. Oh, he, he died. Everybody lowers their head. They're all sad. 
Okay, so, um... Yeah, we get the epic music for a guy dying and handing us his, his ring and his dying breath. Uh, what the ring does, you can't equip it. It's a, uh, yes, it's a keepsake from Scott. It allows the party to view the world map. Yeah, we can view the world map now. What you want to do is hold circle and press select, if I remember right. They don't actually ever tell you that. I don't know how you're supposed to just figure that out. Maybe it was in the booklet or something. So just, just, yeah, we're done here. We're done in town. Um, we can't go into the castle or anything like that, so hold circle, press select, and there you go, the world map. It's um, very colory. Um, so, oh, look, it's an actual, like, sphere, but, like, everything's kind of, yeah, it's kind of weird. Uh, here's a fairy, apparently, that's, uh, Katria and Finn are kind of in, in the same vicinity here. Yeah, our party's there, and there's Altair, so uh, we'll, we have to go back to Altair. We have to deliver the message, so yay, we're errand boys and girl. But we need to go back to Hilda, and everybody back in Altair. We have to deliver the message, pretty much because uh, there's nothing else we can really do. So back to Altair it is. It's not that bad of a journey. I actually haven't even gotten hit yet by any enemy. But just as a reminder, if you do have a healer, you did teach somebody cure, which I hope you did. Um, you want to uh, cure the somebody as soon as they are hit. Not because any particular enemy can kill you or anything like that, but because you want to level up, and the only way to level up anything is to actually do it. So if you want to level up Cure, use Cure, and it'll help out a lot in the long run. Okay, so back to Altair it is. Oh, I should mention status effects. They don't carry over between battles. So I've been poisoned, I, I can't even tell you how many times in this LP so far, and it um, just doesn't matter. You know, as soon as the, the battle's over, we're healed. Um, sometimes it'll it'll just go away in the middle of a battle, too. That last battle, both uh, Luke and Bro got poisoned, and a couple couple turns later, they were they were just fine. Actually, I believe the next turn. Uh, so yeah, 25 gil, mostly because of my MP uh, that needs to be recharged. I haven't shown you guys uh, them going to, to sleep, so... There you go, it's a nice little animation, you know. I don't know why Luke gets in the middle. Nova should definitely be in the middle. We have a Nova sandwich. Uh, they don't give you an option to save. Once again, saving um, happens in the in in the church now, so it's a little different. I'm Gordon. Yes. Ask Wild Rose. Uh, can I show off the ring? Yeah, there we go. So he said I should regain my thank you, brave ones. That's pretty much it. So, uh, yeah, showing him the ring, and then he's like, oh, well, oh, oh, well, well thank you. And that's it. That's, that's all you get. So it's back to Hilda we go. Hopefully she's in her throne room. She is. What's up? The password is Wild Rose. Ask Wild Rose. All right, strong deal. She was, was, but now, well, we'll be kind of fin. Yeah, we've seen all this. Uh, he is not being held in Finn. We looked. That ring. It's Scott, isn't it? Is he alive? We met the prince in Finn. But after he gave us the ring, his strength gave out and... So he gave it to you before he died? Did he say anything? No. No, your highness, nothing. Please keep the ring. No, it should remain with you. It belongs with someone of valor. So does that mean we're engaged now? I, I don't really... Well, I, it, it's good to be the king, but I don't know. Like, I just kind of met you. I don't know what kind of princess you are. Perhaps you can help us. We need someone to find Mithril, the enchanted metal. So, like, seriously? We're, we're on another errand for you? Right, so talk to her again. You can memorize Mithril. And then we can ask her about Mithril. The Battle of Finn, the Empire's equipment far outclassed ours. You're telling me we stood no chance against it. Ow, oh, I went too fast. 
They must have found a mithril mine. I ordered a man in Salamans named Joseph to uh, investigate this possibility, but he's yet to report back. Please go to Salamans with Mindu and look into the matter. Okay. What's up, Mindu? I wish to fire along you. I offer my canoe as well. Mindu joined the party. And we get the canoe. Awesome. See, this game knows how to how to give you the items in order. You get the canoe first, then you can travel the oceans. You don't do it the other way around. Right, go to the eastern port of Paloom to find a ship that will take you there. Youngsters like you would never make it on foot. That's why we got the canoe. Now, wasn't there someone here? I think it was in, he was in the armor shop. It wasn't one of the, somebody here like the greatest blacksmith of all time. Didn't somebody say that? That's where I remember hearing that. Let's check out. Where was it? I swear it was down there. There, there it is. Got all confused. No, it's not the, the armor shop. Maybe it's in the weapon shop. I know there's a guy here. There he is. What's up, dude? I'm a worthless old geezer. Mithril. If only I had mithril to forge weapons and armor. Yeah, I don't know if you have to do that. I've always done that. You probably don't. Uh, but, so yeah, we're off. Off, I guess. Hold on for just one second. Alright, it looks like we're going to move on next time. This is going to do it for this part of Let's Play Final Fantasy 2. I have been Baller Scoob. I hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.